guys, Sagittarius. This is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading. This is for the week of 8-31-2020. Thank you guys for stopping by. As always, if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, subscribe, and retweet. I greatly appreciate it. And so you know, um, if you're seeking a psychic reading, contact me at JackieTomlin.com. Or find a link to those readings below this video. Now, later this week, you will see me go live. And that's going to be for an extended. It's going to be for your entire month of September. If you missed the live broadcast, please find it under the channel's playlist for monthly readings. Okay, so right now, Sag, we are looking at your week of 831. That first week of September 2020. Okay, uh, first of all, there is a need to say no. If there's something that's out of your comfort zone, don't be hesitate to say no, okay? There are new opportunities coming. Um, there is some um, clarity coming to you as well. Something, uh, some realizations are going to come to you, okay? Uh, you're moving forward in a very positive light. There is a celebration ahead, and there are some new doors opening up. So, we've got new opportunities and new doors opening up for Sagittarius. So, let's take a look. And for whatever reason, I, I think I've seen this before. What you do now is setting you up for the winter. Okay? So, Sagittarius, this is your first week. September 2020, the week of August 31st, 2020. So, we have Sag. Sag, we start with the Nine of Staffs, which is your Nine of Wands, the Four of Cups, and the Five of Staffs, Five of Wands. Okay, Sag, first thing we've got is for you to get out of your own head. This is a loss of sleep, okay? This is overthinking things too much because right beside that, we have the Four of Cups, and the Four of Cups is coming in as that unexpected offer of assistance. And with that is the Five of Staffs. Now, the Five of Staffs, Five of Wands, does not mean you have obstacles, okay? But it does show you have challenges. And those challenges are upcoming this week, okay? Moving forward, you guys have the Ace of Cups. You have the Hermit. And we have the Two of Coins. Now, the Ace of Cups... You know, we're maybe in the first week of September, but this is running on up through September 21st. This is a new beginning in love between now and September 21st, okay? And with that, we have the Hermit. Now, the Hermit says, trust your intuition, trust where you're being led. It shows that you're on the right path. And you're doing what you're supposed to be doing for the time being. Two of Pentacles may uh, indicate a little bit of financial stress going on there. You know, that you're juggling a little bit financially. Moving forward, you guys have the Nine of Cups, okay? With that is the Page of Staffs, the Page of Wands, the Sagittarius appearing in Sagittarius. And we have the Seven of Staffs, Seven of Wands. So the Nine of Cups, you know, the one I call the Fat Happy Cat. This is one offer after the other of assistance. This is feeling at peace. This is total happiness and contentment because you are surrounded by offers. And like I said, it's new opportunities. It's new doors opening, things going well. Then we have Sagittarius in a Sagittarius course. That's going to indicate just a wee bit of stubbornness. Imagine that, Sagittarius. Uh, but this could also signify, I believe, that there's going to be another Sagittarius that plays a significant role. Uh, this is also your messenger card. And your messenger card is that Seven of Wands or the Seven of Staffs. And that shows you're checking things off the to-do list. Okay, you're making progress. But there again, you haven't gotten everything done. Because remember, like I said, you also have that Five of Wands that indicates that there are indeed some challenges ahead. So, Sag, what you need to know here, as far as, guys, y'all did not have any major arcanas. None. Okay? But I can say this, another Sagittarius is definitely here and prominent, as well as a Capricorn. A Capricorn may resonate for you guys. <clears throat> and a Taurus. Overall, like I said, clarity, new opportunities, 
and the need to say no to someone that's taking advantage of you. Overall, it looks like a great week. Thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, subscribe, retweet, and I will see you guys soon. Bye.